Have you ever wondered what happens behind the scenes at an animal rescue? I'm Carissa Arndt, founder of Whiskers TNR of Warren County. I'd like to share with you just how one project unfolded and helped more than 40 cats. The call came in July. A retired veteran in Warren County realized that he had more cats than he could care for, 20 at least, many with kittens or litters on the way. Could we help? It's a request that isn't out of the ordinary for Whiskers, but when two of our volunteers traveled the 30 miles across the county to get a feel for the situation, it was heartbreaking. Many of the adult cats appeared healthy, but most of all the kittens were fighting for their lives, their little bodies racked with respiratory illness and intestinal parasites. Whiskers brought back nine kittens and a few adult cats that same day and knew this was the beginning of a long, hard journey. Those first kittens were weighed and with guidance from a veterinarian, given antibiotics and treated for parasites and fleas. Four days later, we headed back to the property when the man said he found another cat with kittens. We found that sweet gray mama, whom we've since named Dion, and the babies she'd been so determined to keep safe that she tucked them away in a garage cabinet. But one of the kittens was lifeless by the time we found them. The other two, Bobby and Whitney, were dangerously ill, their eyes matted shut, and their little lungs fighting for air. So back we came to the Whiskers building with eight more cats and kittens who desperately needed our help, including a cat on the verge of giving birth. And the story continued like this until Whiskers intervened for 39 felines at this property alone. While the goal of Whiskers TNR is to enable property owners to do TNR work themselves, the circumstances of this particular situation meant an intense project for our volunteers, almost from start to finish. And there are still even more cats who need to be spayed or neutered, ones that will be difficult to catch. Our progress so far would have been impossible without the help of the veterinarians and the staff at Animal Medical Clinic Merle Hay and all creatures small, especially Dr. Jacoby, who took the lead in providing initial exams and treatment plans. Whiskers also depended on furry friends and Iowa State University to spay or neuter some of the adult cats who were able to be returned. And then there are the foster heroes. Every volunteer at Whiskers TNR who had capacity to help made room for more cats and kittens in their home. The phrase labor of love comes to mind. Every kitten is weighed every day, given medications as needed, and provided the best nutrition and given lots of love. After all, after their rough start in life, they deserve it. And we want to get them ready to meet their forever heroes, their adopters. In fact, many of these cats and kittens are available for adoption right now. Just look at the kitties labeled 80s music legends on our website. Dion is there and Bobby, a jaunty black and white kitten who now lives to play instead of struggles to live. And Paula and Tiffany and Janet, we could go on. But you won't spot Whitney. Although Whiskers volunteers were able to save her at first, her rough start in life proved too much for her body to overcome. And so we're not done yet. We've seen the tragic outcomes of cats left to reproduce endlessly. We've seen the power that TNR has to change lives. And the calls for help continue to come in.